Good morning from the Coconino National Forest, just north of Flagstaff. It got stupid cold last night, and uh, pipes haven't frozen or anything like that. But I think it takes, it takes a long time for that kind of stuff to kick in, or that, or I'm just not used to how cold it is. So I've been really spoiled by California and Southern Arizona. But now we're back up in the Grand Canyon territory. We're gonna check out the Grand Canyon first, and then we have another very special surprise. Canyon later. Today's a day full of canyons. Let's go do it. It's all frozen. Yeah. So looking forward to having an off-roading break. <laughs> First stop, welcome to the Grand Canyon. We're checking it out again. We were here with Sam like, I don't know, three weeks ago, four weeks ago? It feels like a long time ago, really. A lot of stuff has happened since then. Let's go check it out again. You have to come here. Be amazed. Yeah, just like fuck it. There's no grass. <laughs> I, I don't know what to do. I'm probably gonna take a picture. <laughs> Champ, it's picture time, all right? Everything. <laughs> Seems like this is old news. <laughs> like four times. All right, well, that wasn't very long, but we got to keep moving. We got to keep going. We got an appointment to make. Very excited. You'll see in a second. Canyon and uh, Lake Powell and a lot of this other stuff is all on uh, the Navajo Nation, which means that it's got a different set of rules and a different set of uh, engagements and a different set of tickets you have to get to in order to come up and see it. So we're taking a little tour here. It's actually really affordable. It wasn't bad at all. And uh, they provide like a bus to drive us out and everything. So no complaints at all. And uh, let's go check this out. Navajo Nation, Antelope Canyon. Sweet whip on the way over. Nice. Feels very safe. <laughs> <laughs> the 
feel very disconcerting moving sideways all the way. Okay, stay together. Uh, we only have two warning signs. No smoking, no fighting. So we showed up to the place to get our reservation in, and they're like, oh yeah, there'll be a hoop dance just before they do it. And we're like, hoop dance? I mean, check it out. The guy knows how to dance. Man, this is crazy. That was amazing. That canyon was out of this freaking world. I can't believe that was like a $30 tour. That's amazing. Um, there's a lot more to see up here in Page, and I am going to come back in a bit, but unfortunately we are crunched for time. We got to make a few miles south again because we have to be in Phoenix by noon tomorrow, and I don't feel like waking up at 6 a.m. and driving, so hit the road. See you tomorrow. We're not, I'm still going to vlog some more. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Well, yeah, we didn't get very far. We're gonna go check out Horseshoe Bend now, take an Instagram photo, because that's what everyone does when they get in here. I can't believe you're more afraid of heights than I am. 
I just don't like seeing you near the edge, okay? You were a little too close and then he was all over the place and that was it. Champ has zero fear of heights. Champ, zero fear of heights. Okay. Champ's a freaking champion, man. I rough right up on that edge, doesn't care. No fear in the world. You inspire me, buddy. Getting over my fear of heights. One dangling cliff at a time. Come on. Toss her in. Oh, look at you. Champ, we saw you like two seconds ago. You don't need to get this excited every time we get into the van. <laughs> all right, I made fun of that for the instagram of it all, but seriously, it was really pretty. It was so beautiful. There's so much to see up here. I am so excited to come back up here in a few days and check it all out a little, little bit slower of a pace. But for now, time to drive two hours, find a campsite, and crash. Let's do this. All right, well, that was a lot of driving today. I am sore and exhausted. Like really, really, um, really tired, but really full. We had a great day and uh, we're gonna cap it off with some Simon's take on cheap street tacos, which involves deep fried chicken finger strips. Um, a salsa. Made by yours truly. There you go. <laughs> and we're gonna make up a little mayo sauce. Um, some shredded lettuce, a couple other hot sauces and stuff, and just toss them in, hand tacos. Awesome way to end the night. Awesome spot to cap off the night. We're gonna catch some uh, stars overhead at our wicked free camping spot here, and just uh, take it easy tonight. Good night, everyone. <laughs>